Hi, I'm Gary, and this is my story. For a few years, I have tried to understand what makes me different from most people. Why I can't build a life and manifest like normal people do. It wasn't easy to work out, but what I found is that I can't hold a picture of my life in my mind. I can't keep a hold on it. Whatever I create just gets dropped and lost and cannot be retrieved. It's my understanding that normal people hold a picture of their life, where they've come from, what their life is now, where they're headed, and people live their life from that picture. It's so normal to people that Maybe most people have never even thought that it exists, and that's how that how that they manifest their life from that idea of their life in their mind. And they can adjust it, change their direction, all the while holding that picture of their life for their whole life. It just is always there. But for me, it's not always there, and I can't hold that picture of my life. So as I go along in life, I keep having to recreate it. I live my life from that picture, but I have to keep on creating it again and again. And in a short time, days or weeks, sometimes months, it just drops away and it's gone, cannot be retrieved. That to me explains why I'm not able to, to build anything in my life. That's my, that's the explanation that makes sense to me. I think that I have lost that skill because of ECT, electroshock. I think that I had it when I was a child, but when I was 14 and given electroshock so that I would forget all of the abuse that happened to me, it gave me brain damage that caused me to not be able to hold a picture of my life in my mind. And that's, that explains my life, that one Absent ability really explains my life to me. And I hope other people can understand it as well.